hello everyone and welcome back so today's video is recreating molly may's style instagram photos outfits i actually watch a lot of these videos like recreating celebrity styles and stuff i really enjoy watching them so i put on my instagram asking like who's the first person that you want to see and i was honestly expecting like hayley bieber kim k bella hadid like all of you know that all their kind of street style and honestly every second person was said molly may like i was actually really shocked oh that's what we're doing i'm not gonna lie molly may isn't really like my style yeah so i do like what she wears but after looking at her instagram she wears a lot of black and neutrals and stuff I feel like that is why a lot of people do like her is because she has this kind of basic style but she makes it look really cool if that makes sense like she has like a really cool girl basic style so i was a bit worried that a lot of the these outfits were going to be quite basic and i was trying really hard to look at her more colorful outfits and like i literally went all the way back to like pre love island um and then i kind of thought like this isn't really her style like all black leather like that is her style and that's what people want to see so you know what i mean so anyway I haven't opened the parcels yet i got everything from asos because most of her clothes is from pretty little thing and you know like websites that we all shop on and i didn't want to directly copy anything because i feel like that was kind of cheating but yeah so i've not looked at anything yet so i don't know how anything's gonna look i'm a bit nervous um so yeah so i'm gonna go look through all the outfits and then i'll come back okay i'm genuinely sweating after that so i've got five outfits and then plus like a bonus one so i have six but yeah so okay i'm nervous so the first outfit i'm recreating i'll put it up here um, but it's this kind of neck sleeveless top cycling shorts one of those like college varsity baseball bar jackets and some really funky sunglasses i already had a pair of cycling shorts these are from pretty little thing then i found this little top and it's sleeveless as, as you can see it's got a high neck just like the one that she's wearing and it's actually a bodysuit but looks like a high leg bodysuit because that looks very high so the bomber jacket that she's wearing is from urban outfitters so the jacket i found is i think it's actually men's um but it's extremely like her one her one's got stuff on the back this one has stuff on the back this one also has white sleeves so did hers these are actually leather so i quite like that and i got this in a medium so medium men's because her one is really oversized and i also got these little sunglasses to match hers you know what i actually kind of like these she's wearing like she is in most of her insta photos a designer bag so i'm not really a fan of replica designer or like i don't know things that's supposed to look like designer but it's not I just i'm not really a fan i would rather just buy like a really cute high street bag or something obviously i'm trying to stick as close to what she's wearing as possible but i also don't want to style it in a way that i don't like it so you can actually find a nice bag um to match her one so i've got a few options her dior one has a thick strap which i love the thick strap kind of look so i actually have this thick strap from amazon i want to say it was only like six pounds i got it maybe like two years ago and i wear it with this little steve madden bag that could work with either this bag that i've got or also have this kind of you know i am i'm actually a fat liar because this is meant to look like a balenciaga bag i bought this before like I didn't know that this was meant to look like a Balenciaga bag when I bought it. I also have this bag that I might attach the strap to. She's also wearing like big chunky boots. So I also have these. I already own these. These were from Bershka. It's the first outfit. Like I said, I feel like they are quite basic, but what can you do? Okay, so this is the base of the 
this outfit. This is like a thing on, but that's okay. I've got the cycling shorts, this, the boots. Now we've got the big jacket, which is pretty much identical to her one. I've also done my hair the same. So this is the base of it. She's kind of got it like off the shoulder a wee bit. We've got the sunnies, which are pretty much identical to her ones too. And then I decided to take my strap from Amazon and this like fakey Fugazi Balenciaga bag. And then, yeah, this is it. This is the look. And then, and then this is the back of it, the boots. I feel like I have kind of nailed this one, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, so I feel like I did quite well with this one. This one was easy though, um, but I do feel very Molly May in this. I think the sunglasses definitely make it. I feel like if I didn't have these, it maybe wouldn't be so good. So I was just about to take this outfit off and then I kind of just put the jacket over my shoulders and I actually really like the way that this looks like I feel like it almost looks better like just over the shoulder like quite cool yeah like with the bag like I feel like this almost looks more Molly May I don't I don't know how but but yeah I like this little outfit so that's outfit one so I wanted to try and incorporate a bit of colour um a bit of something different so they weren't all just like black leather outfits a grey tracksuit with and I actually really like this the cutest Balenciaga bag and matching Balenciaga trainers so I originally was searching for a pink bag and trainers and honestly I cannot tell you how hard it was to find a cute pink colour that wouldn't look chavy with grey so I have this just plain grey tracksuit it actually feels really really soft the matching hoodie her one doesn't have white tires so i'm gonna try and hide these when i stick it on but so as i said i couldn't really find anything that was cute in a pink color so i decided to take inspiration from it and go for yellow Just pop of yellow is actually this bag and i know it's not crossbody however i feel like just and it's quite big so i feel like on the shoulder it will be quite of a statement like her one so then for the trainers i love i have a thing with puma trainers i love every single puma trainer that comes out so they're actually these yellow like slightly platform trainers and i know it's not identical to what she's wearing but it's the same kind of vibe i'm recreating it so that is the second look so this is this outfit on so you can't really see but here are the trainers the tracksuit is honestly one of the comfiest things i've ever graced my body with hers is kind of like ruched up that We've got the bag. It is quite a big bag, so I do feel like it gives like a big pop of colour like her one. You could see this shoes like all in one shot, but I don't know, I kind of like this. I do get like school vibes, like walking to school with my handbag and like, I don't know, I think it's maybe because these tyres are there. It makes it look like I've got a polo shirt underneath. Yeah, so... This is this one, obviously it's not identical. It's actually really hard to pull off like a tracksuit with um, like a nice bag and colorful trainers without it looking like quite chavy, I don't know. And I quite like it, I really like these shoes. Like shoes with grey are just so nice together. So the third look I felt I just had to include, like I feel like it wouldn't be a Molly May recreating outfits if I didn't include this so it's this photo here this is such a just typical Molly May look I feel like if you want to kind of recreate her kind of style if you really like her style a black leather blazer and a black hoodie is all you need to have so I'm just gonna wear this black hoodie that I've got this was probably from ASOS and I found this black leather blazer and it's just it's quite 
thin, very structured, but hers isn't doesn't really look that structured either. So yeah, should be quite fitted, but also big enough to go over a hoodie. She's wearing in the photo black, like almost like flared leather trousers. Um, so I've got these ones, they're slightly flared at the bottom. Like I said, she has a designer bag in all of her photos and I didn't actually realise this until I had bought it. But this is actually a Ego and Molly May collab bag. I've got this, oh I found this one that's quite similar kind of vibes to her one. So that is the third outfit. So now we have what I probably call like the signature Molly May outfit. Please ignore my hair. I tried to do it like hers and I haven't straightened it so this looks a bit wild. We've got the like, leather trousers with the flare. We've got the black hoodie and also a black blazer. I feel like most people would probably have like this kind of stuff anyway. This is it all together then this is it with the bag like that. I feel like this is quite Molly May, you know. I mean, you can't really go wrong. It's just like black leather. But so, um, so yeah, I feel like I did kind of nail this, you know. I wish you could see the trousers like full length, but I feel like you can kind of tell there. Actually, I really like this outfit. Like, I even feel like I know she wasn't wearing these in the photo, but is this a vibe? I don't know. Is that a vibe? I feel like I look very undercover with these on, maybe, maybe not the glasses, but like you can't really not like this outfit if you know what I mean, like it's just very casual, very basic, it would be really good if you're like going into town shopping, just getting a coffee, you know. I actually really like this one. So the next outfit, I really wanted to do more of a spring kind of look, Um, so they weren't all you know similar and obviously we've not really been able to go on holiday or anything so she doesn't really have that many kind of looks on her insta just now but i did find this outfit and i really liked it just a really nice spring bright kind of outfit first of all we've got the denim shorts and i feel like these replicate her ones almost identically they are the same kind of like finish on the bottom and they look pretty nice so she's wearing like a cut out bodysuit and i couldn't find one identical to hers but i did find this one which i thought was really cute so it's kind of and i could i could kind of see her in this so it's got these mesh sleeves so it's like tied at the back and then it's got these underwire cups and it's cut out down here her bodysuit is white so is that one but her blazer is actually or it looks cream so i went for this cream blazer and it's also got shoulder pads in it which her one looks like it does too so i think it'll be really nice and structured over the top of the bodysuit then obviously she's got a designer bag so i actually found this one and this one is circular like the one that she's got however i thought to try and match it a bit better i have this bag um, and i'm gonna take the strap off this one and put it on this one because i feel like that will kind of give off the same kind of look i really like that outfit actually i feel like it's a really nice spring summer holiday day in the park like you know you could wear that with trainers you could wear that with heels it's you could do it as like a day to night outfit i really really like really like that outfit so this is the next one so i'll show you everything off so this is the bodysuit and the shorts the shorts i honestly feel like i couldn't have nailed them better if i do say so myself the bodysuit is kind of similar not identical the only thing i'll say is I obviously have quite a short body because this like doesn't kind of like sit how it should but other than that it's a really nice bodysuit I think the sleeves and everything are really cute obviously we have the cream blazer so this is it with the blazer it's not identical but same kind of vibe so this is the bag like let's pretend this little strap isn't there um and I really like this bag with 
this outfit. I think it's really cute. In her one, she's got a little Louis Vuitton bag. Um, this is it with like the little brown strap that I had. I quite like this as well. I think this is really cute for spring. I actually kind of prefer it just like the bag how it is, but I just wanted to try and recreate her outfit the best that I could. I think some really nice like nude and gold heels with this could be really cute. Also trainers. Um, if you wanted to like make it kind of casual. Yeah, so I actually quite like the outfit as well. I feel like we're doing quite well so far. Okay, so this outfit is actually one that I'm really excited about. As soon as I decided that I was going to do Molly May, this, like when she posted this, I was like, oh my God, I really want to try and do this one. So this outfit here, the dress I believe is a designer dress. I actually think it's a Jack, Jack Miz, Jack, I don't know. You know what I'm trying to say. So, obviously i mean pretty little thing or misguided or someone will probably come out with a dress very similar very soon however they have not came out with one yet so i have went for this black bodycon dress and i had to get one that was low cut. well you can't see against my black hoodie but that was low cut cause to go over the top of it i have a few options so i've got this blazer cropped blazer to go over the top of the dress to give off the same kind of vibe but obviously this one has got long sleeves so i have also bought a few other options i've also bought just a black t-shirt to give off the short sleeve vibe i've also bought a black v-neck t-shirt to try and mimic the style of like the a blazer so i'm really hoping when i try that on it's all really gonna come together but i don't know we'll see so this is the base of the outfit i actually really like this this was really cheap it was only like 10 pounds or something so it's just this little mini dress so option one is um a blazer which was kind of my first thought when i seen the outfit and i feel like it would maybe look better if this was like a little bit higher um, it's almost like just a wee bit too long. This is kind of like my first recreation of her little outfit. Maybe if it was more like cropped like there, that looks a bit better actually. Um, if I tucked it up a wee bit, that's pretty good actually. That is, I'm getting the vibes, I'm getting the vibes off this. That's the first option with the blazer. This one pretty similar it does look kind of this is a big t-shirt so I don't think this looks too bad um I feel like maybe even cropped a bit more because her one is quite cropped but I feel like this does kind of just look like like a t-shirt like a t-shirt dress so then next we just have the normal black t-shirt so again I don't know it's not really giving off the vibe I was hoping for so yeah, I feel like the t-shirts kind of do just give it that like t-shirt dress kind of kind of look. I don't know, I think the blazer definitely looked the best. And the last outfit, so I kind of said this was like a bonus outfit because this isn't really like her one, but it kind of is. It's the same idea. The last outfit is this one. I feel like this when she posted this i was like oh my god i love that blazer i just and i think it's from an insta boutique i seen quite a lot of them doing it at the time so when i was on asos i was just scrolling and i actually came across this dress so i feel like it gives off the same kind of vibe because it's got this like mesh kind of like stuff on the side I felt like i should maybe include this because it's quite similar but yeah so this is kind of like a bonus one okay, so yeah so this is this one on obviously it's not exactly like the picture because this one was like a bonus one got my hair in a bun like her we've got this big piece of mesh i've got this bag from one of the first outfits just to go with it just to kind of match the vibe that she was going for so yeah i kind of like it i quite i would wear this if i had something to wear it to it's a bit annoying it kind of keeps falling down but but yeah i quite like this one okay so i've just tried them all on it's now like almost half past 
midnight and I am so tired. I'm just, I haven't even bothered tidying up yet. Now I need to go edit my video, but yeah. So I do look a bit rough now. I do feel like I nailed some of them. So, you know, I don't think I did that bad. I think I did quite well, but I hope you enjoyed. I kind of want to make this into like a little series. I want to do loads of other people. I want to do someone suggested Princess Diana. That would be really fun. I really want to do Hayley Bieber. I love her street style. I really want to do Bella Hadid. I really want to do um, maybe some like Vanessa Hudgens like festival looks that could be quite fun like lively oh my god love her there's so many i could do so if there is anyone that you would like me to do next please let me know i this has probably been one of my favorite videos to film just because i love piecing things together i love searching for them i love finding them so like my christmas day outfit in school valentine's like they're my kind like i love filming those yeah, so if you got any suggestions please let me know and um, I hope you enjoyed and thank you for watching and I will see you in my next video.